Geek Bandit Media here again with another video. Today, I thought I would go ahead and show y'all what cards I do have for the sets that uh, I just explained in my last video for those sets. So, I'm not going to talk your head off on this one. I'm just going to show you what cards I have and I'm going to tell you which set they coincide with or which set they belong with for the younger viewers um now I can tell you that some of these sets I do not have a lot of um some sets I have quite a few but I don't have the the ones that I would like to have so anyways without further ado let's get into this um the first set this set right here is Fates Collide and we have a Altaria EX very pretty card we have a Mega Audino EX I think that's a really pretty card too we have a Kingdra EX a Genesect EX a Bronzong break card. And I'm sorry for the glare on it. I do keep them in sleeves so that way they don't get that way they don't get hurt. One of my favorite Pokemon is Umbreon. Umbreon EX. I have two of these Zygarde EX cards. Zygarde Zygarde always looked like a like a Power Ranger or something. You know when the Power Rangers like a bad guy? He looked like a Power Rangers bad guy. Like when he... Look at him. Doesn't that look like a Power Rangers bad guy to you? Like whenever they grow real tall and they all jump in their suits and uh... just looks like he's a bad guy. We have a Regirock EX. We have a Mega Alakazam EX. That's also another one of my. Whenever the first gen came out, Alakazam, whenever I started, because I used to watch the TV show too, not just play the games. But, uh, have a full art. Glaceon EX. Really pretty card. I really like that card a lot. I have it in a super protective sleeve. And this card was the card. This card and one other card was the card to get in this set. And, uh, yeah, you can probably see me in the background out there recording. But, anyways, this card is my most favorite card out of this set. Along with the one right behind it, you can see it on the table. Um, Mega Alakazam EX. Alakazam was one of my favorites from uh, from the first generation. Umbreon was my favorite from the, I believe he was from the second generation. And uh, yes, I do have two of those, and I also have two of these Mega Alteria EXs. And then, this was the card that I was wanting to get out of here, was the Team Rocket's Handiwork. Really, really pretty card. And like, I, like I've said before in my videos, the trainer cards are my favorite. And I really wanted to get this card so bad. And I got lucky and did. Well, that's all I have for Fates Collide. Next is going to be Dragon Majesties. I have a white, sorry, it runs in my family, my handshake. White Kirim GX. I have the Salamance GX. Altaria GX. Dragonite GX. 
I have a Full Art Alteria GX. I thought that was a really pretty card. I have a Full Art Kingdra GX. I have a Xenia Full Art Trainer Supporter card. I have a Hyper Rare White Kiram. Uh, this is the Nagadendale that came in the set. I've got two of those. They came with the Elite Trainer boxes whenever you bought them. So that means y'all know I at least bought two Elite Trainer boxes. But there's the Nagadendale GX that evolves from Poi Pole. And um, if you didn't get a good look at it, he's he's a hard guy. He looks looks kind of funky, man. Some of these Ultra Beasts just, I don't know. Y'all tell me. Alright, next set. This is a small set. This is uh, Shining Legends. Um, I have a Zorart GX. I have a Entei. GX two of those actually who was y'all's favorite um who was y'all's favorite legendary dog pokemon Entei, Raikou or Suicune these are these are my f I love these shining pokemon cards any shining pokemon cards I love them shining volcanian And I have a Shining Genesect. I want the Shining Mew so bad. And I'm also missing the um, in this set there is a card that they refer to as the Mew 2 Laboratory card. And um, I do not have it, and I do not have the Shining Mew, and those were the two most, those were the two most, uh, sought after cards in that set. This is Team Up. I have the Venusaur and Celebi Team Up cards. I have two of them. I have a Pikachu and a Zekrom. That is a very good card to play in a game. Um, Ampharos GX. This is one of my favorite cards out of this set. Gengar Mimikyu. I love the way Gengar is looking in that picture. Cobra Lion. I think he's kind of funky looking. I have two of these Latios and Latias cards. I have the Snorlax and Eevee team up. Tag team, sorry. I have the Magikarp and Whale Lord full art card. I have the Gengar and Mimikyu full art card. I have the Incineroar full art card. I have two of the Ingo and Emmets. Put one down. They just look like they're up to no good. And then I have Anita. I think she was the first one. No, Ingo and Emmett was the first one I pulled out of the set. And then I pulled Anita right after. I just recently pulled the Sabrina Suggestion. Which is the card to get, I believe, out of this set. Sabrina was my favorite gym leader. And then I have a Hyper Rare Ampharos. He's hard to see in this card, but I have a Hyper Rare of him. And that's all for Team Up. Now, this is the newest set and for those of you that have been watching my channel you know 
you've probably already seen these, but for those that haven't, I got a Dragonite GX out of Unified Minds. These all are Unified Minds cards. Dragonite GX, that's about a $15 card as of right now. Oh no! I killed him! I killed Gary! I mean Blue. <laughs> I got a Blue's Tactics, and that's why you put your cards in sleeves, boys and girls. I have a Keldeo Full Art GX card. Really pretty card. A Mawile GX. A Weevil GX. Boy, he just looks like he's about to mess somebody up, don't he? I have two of these Mega Sableye and Tyranitar cards. I have a Keldeo GX. I have the card I wanted. I almost wanted this card just as bad as the Blues Tactics. But I have the Slowpoke and Psyduck. I would love to have the alternate art. And there's that other. There's the other Mega, Mega Sableye and Tyranitar card. And that's all I've got so far of Unified Minds. Next. We're going to go to Evolutions. I have two of these Venusaurs. As you can see. Then I have a Mega Venusaur. And I put this Charizard in here, guys, because I have opened booster box after booster box of these cards out of evolutions and this is the only Charizard card that I have and yes he's holographic but I did not get him out of a booster box I had to go buy him from a card shop near me I have two Charizards I have two Ninetales just not right here Nine Tails break card. I have the Blastoise EX. I have the Slowbro EX. I have two Mega Slowbro. I mean, I'm sorry. Yeah, that, that's right. Never mind. Slowbro EX. I have a Mega two Mega Slowbro EXs. That face he's making. Like, I want food. Feed me. <laughs> I got a Star Me Break card. And I put this card in here because I love Mew. And most Mew cards are beautiful to me. And so is this one. I love that artwork on that card. But, uh, I just. I wanted this. It took me a while to pull him, and I put him kind of like the story with the Charizard. So I put him in a protective case, too. Mm, spoiler alert. Got him a champ break. I got a Pidgeot EX. Dragonite EX. I got the Full Art Mega Venusaur EX. I got the. The card to get in this set was a Mega Char was the Mega Charizard EX, and I have it right here. I got a that's the full art version. I have a full art version of the Pidgeot EX. Really, really pretty card. I love how it looks like the background in that card looks. I have another Mega Pidgeot EX. This one's really pretty too. I have a, uh, well, I have two Dragonite EXs. And these are all the um, secret rares. I have two of some of them. I have, well, actually, I have three or four of all of them. I just, I have three or four of all of them except for this one. The, uh, the executor. I don't, I don't have but one of him. That's the only one I have of him. But all these other ones I have like five or six of them. Three or four of him. 
two or three of him and like 17 of them. <laughs> Y'all know how that is. If, you, if you're a real Pokemon collector, you know what I'm talking about. If you buy booster boxes, you're going to get at least probably two or three of each in, in a booster box sometimes. Sometimes. Not all the time. Well, guys, we're down to the last set, and uh, hopefully this won't be as long a video. Uh, this is from Unbroken Bonds, and this is my biggest set that I've got. Um, although the pull rates for this are horrible. Um, I have two of this Buzzswole and Fer Ferramosa. I've got two of the Venomoth GXs. I've got two of the Blastoise GXs. I've got the Muck and Alolan Muck tag team card. I've got the Marshadow and Machamp tag team card. Sorry, I went blank there for just a second. I've got two of the Greninja and Zorark GX cards. I've got four Haunch Crow GX cards. I've got the Gardevoir and Sylveon. Very pretty tag team GX. I've got a Persian. I've got a Celestelia GX. I've got four. Now, I, you hear I'm not complaining in this. I've got four. If you saw my last video, you know I have four of these Reshiram and Charizard GX Ultra Rare cards. And then we get into my Ultra, my, my, my Full Art cards. I have a Buzzswole and Ferramosa Full Art. I have the Marshadow and, Mar Ch and Machamp Full Art. This card, Marshadow and Machamp, this card, Full Art, is my favorite card out of this whole set. Besides the Reds Challenge card. Um, I do not have the Reds Challenge card, but this card out of this whole set is my favorite one. And it's because it has that beautiful sunset in the background. I just think that's so cool. Them sitting there looking at the sunset. And you can see there's like a like a sea down, like an ocean or something down there at the bottom. And then... I have the full art of the Greninja and Zordark. Really cool looking card. I have the full art of the Gardevoir and Sylveon. I have the full art of the Persian GX. And then I have like 17 Celestillas. <laughs> I do have three of them. No joke. And then I have my... Another trainer card, Koga. One of the first gen people back again. That's awesome. He looks like he's getting kind of old though, don't he? <laughs> I have a Hyper Rare Muck and a Lowland Muck. I have a Hyper Rare Haunch Crow. Like, who wants that? <laughs> I have a Beast Bringer. A Electromagnetic Radar. Say that 17 times fast. Another one. I have a Metacore Barrier. And I have a Pokegear 3.0. I'm sorry for for those out there that say O oh, isn't a number. A Pokemon a Pokegear 3.0. And for now and now I'm gonna show you my binder. In my binder I have a Mega Rayquaza EX. I have two of them I believe. Uh, just like that. Not, then there's another Mega Rayquaza EX. And then there's just another Rayquaza GX, EX. And then I have some promo cards. That are very pretty. The Machamp is not a promo card. It's from Ancient Origins. Um, and the rest are promo cards. The rest are um, Zekrom, and then we go to the next page, and I have promo card. 
I believe that those promo cards right there are from the uh, Legendary Collection. And then I have a Suicune GX from Lost Thunder. And I have a Espeon GX from Sun and Moon Base Set. And then, if you check this bad boy out. I bought him recently from TCA Gaming. And I just want to say thank you, Rusty, for sending me that. It is a, a really, really just blew my mind touching it and and seeing this card again. I used to have it when I was a kid, and I don't anymore. And um, he really just really, really brought back the nostalgia for me. So thank you. Thank you so much, Rusty. And then, if y'all really want nostalgia, all these cards are from the Jungle Base Set 2, Regular Base Set. All of these cards are. And I just fossil, 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 team rocket, rocket, rocket. There's a fossil golem or golem, graveler, and geodude. See, how, see what I did there? See what I did there? <laughs> Uh, there's a Grimer and a Ekans and a Zubat. And then I got, I just, I got all these different cards. Shout out to Leonhart. There's his favorite Squirtle, man. Right there. Um, Sabrina's Haunter. Right there. Blaine's Charmeleon. Just just the nostalgia factory at work. Misty's Wrath. Brock's Primeape. Erica's Ivysaur. And there's Bayleaf. Snubble. And Zatu. And then the last page I've got a Cedra. Magmar, Cyndaquil, another Cyndaquil, another Cyndaquil, and a Quilava. And I think that's it, guys. I don't think I got any. Ooh, there we go. There's the last page. Yep, I got a holographic Mr. Mime from Jungle. I got a legendary collection shaman ex i also have a legendary collection y'all correct me if i'm wrong but i do believe that is a legendary collection um mew i've got a holographic raichu from base set i've got a holographic dark gobat from here comes team rocket set i got a regular non-holographic misty's tentacle I got the promo Mewtwo that they gave out at the movie theaters, I believe. Like I said, correct me if I'm wrong. And then I've got a holographic Azumarill from, I believe, one of the Neo sets. And then this card right here, you guys, check this out. It's a miscut card. See the corner of the card right there? It's a miscut. So... Anyways, and these on the back right here are also like super duper misprinted. See how high up that is shifted and it's the same on the back. And then we got Imposter Oaks Revenge, Holographic Sabrina, and a challenge card. I always love that challenge card the way they had all the Pokemon in there. But anyways, guys, that's all I got for you today. Uh, I hope you enjoy going through my collection with me so far. Uh, I hope it continues to grow. 
and uh, I hope y'all continue to grow with me. Um, please, if you don't mind, hit the subscribe button, like this content, like my video, and share it with people. If you have a kid that, that loves Pokemon and loves opening Pokemon and loves watching people just is nuts about Pokemon, send him on to my channel. I'm family friendly. I won't be using any bad foul language. And I post videos for, for right now just as soon as I can, but I'll at least have one up every Saturday by, by lunchtime. So, if you would, please, like I said, like, share, and subscribe my video. This has been Geek Bandit Media. Y'all have a great night. Or day. Or whatever.